In the small town of Decono, Dante Larks committed horrific sex crimes against a child. What he did here coming to light after he was convicted in Well County of multiple charges involving a minor. The arrest warrant for Larks said a child was locked in a room for many nights over several months. The victim wasn't allowed out of the basement except for a few hours. At times, the child had to go to the bathroom in a bucket. The victim said Larks would throw peanuts down the stairs. That's what the child would eat most days. Larks, the court affidavit said, would sexually assault the victim while the defendant was armed with a gun. Among the charges, child abuse with serious bodily injury. So this is a significant case. Typically, we see serious bodily injury as a gunshot wound, a knife wound, a broken bone. In this case, uh, the district attorney was able to prove beyond a reasonable doubt to a jury that the victim in this case uh, suffered serious bodily injury in the form of psychiatric trauma and permanent damage uh, emotionally. Child psychologist Dr. Cheryl Ziegler says children who are sexually assaulted experience years of negative emotions. In the cases of child sexual assault, we see a lot of outcomes that look very similar to PTSD. It would be things like uh, hypervigilance and not trusting of others, nightmares, insomnia. It impacts every single part of a child's life. Larks is now in the Well County Jail and facing 142 years to life in prison.